We have breaking news coming into the Situation Room. Police have been called to Trump Tower in New York City after reports of multiple, multiple suspicious package packages found outside Trump Tower. CNN's Bryn Jin Grash, she joins us now from New York. Tell us, Bryn, what the police are saying about this. Yeah, actually, Jim, what we're hearing is those packages are inside Trump Tower. What I'm hearing from a source, and again, this is preliminary information as it comes in uh, to the NYPD, Secret Service, other authorities, is that there were three suspicious packages in three separate locations inside Trump Tower. I want to get out of the way so you guys can get a quick look at the street. This is a fi uh, Fifth Avenue right here where Trump Tower is, and you can see it's shut down uh, for cars. On the scene here is Bomb Squad. We also have the emergency service units, uh, and there's just a number of streets closed around this area. I was actually walking toward Trump Tower for something separate uh, when I saw the bomb squad race by me along with other uh, emergency vehicles. So at this point, we know there's a lot of officials inside Trump Tower, heavily armed people uh, standing guard trying to figure out exactly what those packages are, where they are. This is obviously a much heightened more response since it's inside Trump Tower. Uh, but certainly we're going to stay on this and see uh, what this is all about. Jim. We should know that the president is not now at Trump Tower in New York. I believe he's on his way to Bedminster. But, but Bryn, this is a highly secured site, uh, the White House North, as it's sometimes called. Uh, tremendous security there. How rare would it be to get something inside the building as opposed to outside the building? Well, there are stores inside the building. There's a Starbucks, uh, there's a Gucci store uh, on the ground level. Uh, so there are tourists that are often going inside Trump Tower. Uh, so it's possible the device or the rather packages were found in those uh, communal areas where people often are. Uh, I'm not sure yet if those uh, packages are in the residential area, in offices. We're still trying to find out that information, but it wouldn't be too difficult. It could be something where someone spotted something that didn't look right and then investigated Investigators found that there's multiple of those, and that's why it's causing even more alarm. Um, I can tell you that while I was standing guard uh, waiting to see how this unfolds, people who live inside Trump Tower can't even get to their homes right now. I mean, it is completely shut down at the moment. And as you can see, obviously, the streets around here quickly getting cleared uh, by the police that are around uh, really uh, a one block radius all around Trump Tower at this point. Abundance of caution. Bryn Gingrass, thanks very much. And if you're just joining us now, uh, as Bryn was updating us there, the NYPD looking into reports of three suspicious packages inside, it appears, Trump Tower in New York, uh, the White House North, as it's known. We should note that the president not currently at Trump Tower, but certainly uh, a, a serious question there about security. And we're going to stay with this story uh, throughout this hour.